Hey everybody, Scorpion here. So we're going to attempt to uh, scrap out and see if there's anything decent in this uh, scanner here. Um, this is for like scanning your groceries and you're, you know, checking out that kind of thing. Start off with the, the end here. It's got gold pins. <clears throat> And I'm watching you guys prospecting while uh, while I'm making this video here. So uh, y'all stay tuned. Let's see what this thing has in it. Rock, 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 bottle on the track, boy. So let's see if we can't turn y'all down a little bit. So maybe y'all can see what's going on here. Without dropping any of you guys. There we go. Let's turn her up just a little bit. <clears throat> so of course we're gonna start off with the easy. Easy stuff. Now, I don't leave the ends if there's any type of anything in the wire going through. I take that out as well. I don't leave that. I only put the wire in the wire bag, try to be honest. Um, I did call around today to a couple of the uh, different scrap yards in my area, and uh, two of them told me that they only pay. this right here power supplies out of computers they only only play pay uh, shred six cents per hundred whatever um, I've got one that told me that and uh, two of them that are checking to see if I can get aluminum breakage for them if I can get aluminum breakage for them they're gonna be getting all my business more than likely <clears throat> So this goes in the gold finger bucket or the gold end bucket. This is shred. Let's see if we can't break into this bad boy. This is the thing as a kid, you always want to stare in it, you know. You're like, don't look in it, it's bad for your eyes. It's one of those things, I can't help it, Mom. It sucked me in. So let's see what all the goodness is inside of here that just sucks you in and doesn't want to let you go away. So here's a red lens. Great for putting on a flashlight for a prepping thing. Um, reduces your visibility. You got your little thing in here that spins. Some boards. Wow. It's two boards stacked in there. Let's see what we can find here. First, we gotta figure out how it comes out. Doo -doo -doo. All right. I get some tools. Start doing a little work. There's no screws back here. All this stuff should just snap in. Looks like there's some type of board in the back too. They may want to all come out as one piece. That might be what the issue is. Alright. 
a lot of pressure on this thing. Well, I ain't had something be this big of a pain in a while. plug into the back of it right there so that's another uh another one of those gold ends grab hold of that and yank it out maybe only if we're lucky there we go so, toss that over in the gold ends Let's see what we got in here. We definitely have a bunch of old plastic housing, some screws to the shred pile. There's going to be a little motor that runs that. This piece is snapped onto the boards. So that should release that. And remember y'all we're scrapping here so if you break something it's it's no big deal there's one in the center there that one's actually got a screw in it there we go no gold on the cable no gold on that cable no gold no gold all right so here's what we have in here now i would say this is probably worth scrapping that's a whole lot of chips on that little board right there some yellow tantalums there but uh yeah so i'll have to check to see what these go as um if I had to guess, I would think it would probably go as telecom, to be honest with you. At least this one with everything that's on it. It's quite interesting. So we've got this wire here. I believe that's what runs the laser. Yep. And we've got this one here. And then we've got this here that went to something. No idea. And uh, we do have a little board over here. on it so it would fall in the, the low grade that laser there it's an aluminum thing but there's no way you can get everything else out so it'd probably be um, dirty aluminum the AU guys has two other people on their live with them oh no just one pop that out and throw it in dirty aluminum to be honest with you mm -hmm. alright let's see here so you got a brass fit in here this is a motor. I'm 
not sure if it's glued on there or what. I'll just drop that whole thing over the motor as it is. So we end up with wires here, some dirty aluminum, a motor, a cheap board. It should be a decent price board. And then this may fall mid grade or something like that. And a little bit of shred. So not a lot to them, but definitely I'm pretty impressed by this board here. I uh, was not expecting it to be that um, that much on the board. A um, bunch of a couple of flat packs and some ICs and crystal oscillators and good stuff. So hope y'all enjoyed seeing what was inside one of those laser places. I've seen them a few places, but um. Basically, that's it. Y'all have a good one.